Today, we're holding a zombie security house-building competition. Oh! Good idea, JJ! That sounds like fun! I'm going to build a security house that can hold off any number of zombies! All right, I'll build here! Let's see who can build the strongest anti-zombie security house. A competition with JJ! Yay! Okay, first I'll build my house's frame. Hmm. Yeah, I want it to be sturdy, so I'll build it with iron. I'll start by laying out the blocks to build the frame. I want to make a nice big house with this. All right, that should do it for the house's frame. Oh, Mikey's hard at work. I'm doing my best. Mine will be more impressive than yours. Mm-hmm, let's give it our all. Next, I want to reinforce my house by using security lasers. First, I'll make the pillars. And then I'll place the lasers here. I'll surround my entire house with lasers like these. Okay, my security lasers are complete. Basically, it's impossible to reach the area around my house now. But there's just one problem. I can't even get into my own house. I'll use slime blocks to build a jump device. Now I can leave the property to go outside and still get back in from the outside. Uh, how's it going, Mikey? Hmm, I'm putting in windows so I can see outside. This is definitely going to be an amazing security house. Oh, it's really coming along, Mikey. I need to pick up the pace. Okay, I think I'll work on the interior of my house next. First, I'll put in some glass windows so I can see what's going on outside the house. Fill it in here. And the secret passage is complete. I'll try pushing the button. I'm in. The tunnel leads here. Now when I push the button, I'm able to enter the house. Hey Mikey, how's it going? I'm working really hard on my interior right now. It's going well. It's really coming along, Mikey. Alrighty then, I need to do more. I'd like to work on increasing my anti-zombie security measures next. See these walls? I want to place turrets here. And now, if I pull the lever, the gun will automatically attack zombies. This is the ultimate turret. Now that the first floor is done, I want to work on the second floor. I'll make a hole leading to the second floor and place some ladders there. All right, up I go. This is the second floor. Oh, hi, Mikey. Oh, hey, JJ. I'm working on how I'll fend off the zombies when they come. Whoa, oh, you're really working hard on it. I'll try to keep up. Now then, the second floor has a great view, and it's perfect for getting a handle on the situation outside. To make sure zombies can't climb onto the roof, I'm going to set up some security lava. I'll place a bucket of lava into this dispenser. Then I'll add more dispensers here. Just like this. There are buckets of lava in all of these. I'm placing them all along the roof. Next, I'll connect them all together using redstone. Then, I'll place redstone dust along the outside. I'm hooking them all together with a redstone circuit to activate them. Okay, the redstone circuit is complete. Now, if I push the button, the lava should pour out like so, fending off any zombies that try and climb my walls. Ho-ho! That's really nice! And with that, my security house is complete. I wonder how Mikey's doing. Oh, are you already finished too, Mikey? Oh, JJ! My anti-zombie security house is complete! Isn't it awesome? Whoa! Show me how it all works, Mikey. Sure! Well, check this out. Look, here I go! This is a cobweb barrier. Ah! The cobwebs slow you down when you get caught in them, so the zombies won't be able to reach my house. Interesting. The cobwebs are there to slow the zombies down. But how are you going to get inside, Mikey? JJ! All I have to do is jump over there! Ready? <laughs> I messed up! I got caught! Oh! Oh! Whoa! <sighs> well, it's not easy to jump over that. 
It could be a problem if you get caught when there's zombies around. Hmm, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm confident that I won't make any mistakes during a real zombie invasion. JJ, look at this next! What are those? These are... Arrow launchers! How do they work? Just watch! Ready? Mm-hmm. Woohoo! Yay! Whoa, that's awesome! <laughs> yeah! Whoa! Pew, pew, pew! How does it work? Whenever I pull this lever, it shoots out a bunch of arrows! Booyah! They don't fire automatically? Of course not! I don't know how to make them automatic, so I made them operate manually. There's no problem with how they work, though. See? It's manual, but it definitely has no problems functionally. Hmm. Huh, Mikey, the door to your house. Yeah? Are you sure it should be wood? Huh? It's not a problem. I'll stop the zombies from ever reaching my door with my arrow launchers. They won't even get close. Still, I feel like zombies can break through a wooden door. It's fine. No worries. Actually, Mikey. Huh? Your interior is quite luxurious. Oh, JJ, you noticed. But there's no need for it to be this nice. There's plenty of stuff you don't need to secure yourself against zombies in here. Hmm, that's true. But I really wanted it to look nice inside. <laughs> Just look at it, JJ. I even have diamonds on the wall. Hmm. Over here, I prepared lots of treasure, too. See? I've become quite attached to this security house. Thanks to all the fancy stuff I have in it. I like it so much I wouldn't mind living here forever! Hmm, I see, but still, it's certainly a very nice interior. I know, right? Isn't my security house awesome? I'll definitely be able to survive no matter how many zombies come after me. I love my security house! It's night, Mikey. The zombies are coming. It's time to find out whose security house is stronger. All right. Ah, zombies! DJ! Wow! Yikes! Zombies! Into your security house! Ah, ah, I'm going in! They're coming! Hurry, Mikey! Whoa! I jumped over the cobwebs! Nice! Whoa! Shoot! They're coming for me, too! I'll use the jumping device to hop over the lasers. All right. Whoa, here they come! There's so many zombies coming! Those lasers should- Oh, ah, ah, they're getting in! Into the secret entrance! Okay, through the passage, and then use the jumping device to get inside. Whoa, wow! There are already so many zombies here! All right, now I'll activate the turrets, and let the guns deal with the zombies. Woohoo! They're shooting them automatically! I just have to wait for the guns to fight the zombies for me. All right, much better. The turrets have taken care of the zombie threat. Woohoo! Uh, how are you doing over there, Mikey? No problems here! Piece of cake! I'm fighting off the zombies with arrows! Keep it up, Mikey. Let's both survive this. Let's do it! Okay, let's go up to the second floor and take a look around. Let's see. I might as well take the golden apples and flamethrower I prepared. I'll eat one now. All right, up to the second floor. Whoa, Mikey's house is surrounded by zombies. Uh, hang on. Yikes, my house is still surrounded by zombies. All right, in that case, I'll fight them off with this flamethrower. It's time to take out the zombies. Woohoo! Whoa. There sure are a lot of them. Oh, hang on. Oh, the zombies are climbing up! This is bad. This is bad! It'll be okay, though. Don't forget, I still have security lava. Security lava switch on. Whoa! The zombies don't stand a chance at getting up here thanks to my security lava. All right, all right! Now to turn the security lava back off. Uh, Mikey, how are you doing? I'm in trouble! Zombies got inside my house! They broke down my wooden door! Oh. What? Uh, get to the roof! Uh, to the roof! Huh. Okay! Whoa! I made it! 
I never thought they'd be able to get inside! I hope they don't wreck the luxurious inside of my house! I don't know… Uh, Mikey, the zombies are trying to climb onto the roof! No kidding! This is what I have buckets of water for! Ugh. I'm stuck! Mikey's caught in the cobwebs! No! Oh, Mikey! Wow, I slept really well. It's morning already. Time for my exercises. Uh, or maybe not. Huh? Ah! Are those zombies? Why are there zombies everywhere? Oh man, I'm surrounded. This is bad. Uh, what now? What am I gonna do? Huh? Ah! huh? Ah! Hmm? Ah! Wait a sec. Mikey! The village is full of zombies! I'm so scared! What do we do? Mikey! Huh? Look over here! Oh? Hey! <gasps> Gigi! It's you! Don't go outside! It's way too dangerous out there! What are we gonna do? Hang in there! I'll take care of the zombies! Huh? I have a bow in here! Okay… Oh! But I only have six arrows! Whatever. Let's see if I can deal with these zombies. I'm gonna go up to the roof now. Good luck up there! Whoa, they spotted me already! Oh man, there's way too many of them! Can you beat them? I'll try. Take this! Got one! Again! Oh! Yes! It's working! Can you beat all the zombies? Yeah! Oh, uh-oh. I ran out of arrows. That's no good. Mikey, I can't shoot the zombies without ammo. Oh, man. What? Let's try to join up. Where are you? In my house! Wait a sec. It would be really bad if I fell down there. That's Mikey's house. I'm gonna try and jump onto his roof. I'll need a running start if I want to make it. Okay. Go! <sighs> Whoa, that was close. Ugh, yikes. Those zombies would have beat me in a second. Let's go down the chimney. Looks a little hot, but I'll just push through. Here we go. Ouch! Huh. Whoa! Oh! JJ! Mikey! This is terrible! The village is full of zombies! You're right. <laughs> well, breaking past all of the zombies to escape the village might be impossible. Does that mean we have to try and make a life here? Surrounded by them? Really? I mean, that might be our only option. Oh. Wait! Hmm? I just remembered! I have some emergency supplies! Really? That's great! It's good to be prepared. Where are your emergency supplies, Mikey? They're buried here! Here's a shovel. Thanks! I'm sure it's around here. Try to stay out of their reach. Right. Let's see… So, you buried your emergency supplies in your yard? Found it! Hmm? Oops! You okay? Yes! Here it is! Uh… It's all here! What is it? Well… Da-da-da-da! Ta-da! Is that it? Uh-huh! It's… cookies? Let's eat them together! We'll split them. Yeah! Thank you, Mikey. Let's eat. Mm, yummy! Oh, wow. These really hit the spot. <laughs> Definitely! Hmm. This is my entire emergency supply. You saved us with your cookies. Mm -hmm. These could last for days. You think so? Let's stay in your house until all the zombies go away. All right! Why are the zombies still here? We ran out of emergency cookies, and I'm getting so hungry! We're running out of options, Mikey. Huh? We need to go gather supplies. But… the zombies? How can we go out there? I have an idea. Yeah? Look! Huh? See across the street from your house? Uh-huh. There! Mm-hmm. It's a neighboring house. There has to be some supplies inside, right? But… Yeah? There will be lots of zombies in our way! That's okay. There's a way we can reach that house without going outside. Really? How? 
I was thinking we could dig a tunnel from your house to that one over there. Oh! I'm sorry about this, Mikey. We're gonna have to destroy your floor. It's okay. So, this is how we'll tunnel through the ground. Let's get digging! Just like this. Yeah! Okay. Let's go! This way. Mm -hmm. Now we'll tunnel through. We'll connect the houses. Yeah. Cool. We'll go underground to connect them. Right above us are zombies, so be careful. Okay. <sighs> Watch where you dig, okay? How's my position? I'm gonna check. Mm -hmm. How far is it? If I dig from the wrong spot, we're gonna be attacked by zombies. That would be really bad. It looks about that far. Okay, I'll tunnel two spaces to the left. You're sure? Yep. Okay. Here, we'll dig our way up, and if I'm right, we should be inside of that house. Really? Probably. Huh? Oh, see? There's cobblestone. If we break a hole in the cobblestone, then it should lead to the other house. I'm gonna try. Oh! Oh! Bingo! Wow! Yes, we did it! Awesome! Wow! All right, we made it to the other house. We did it! Wow, I can't believe that plan worked. That's incredible! Good job! Hmm. It's perfect! Yes! Oh! Let's see what we can find. Whoa! Huh? A skeleton? Oh! Whew. Look! I know! There's a chest behind you! Really? There might be supplies inside! Let's take a look! Alright! Three, two, one! Open! Hmm? Oh wow! That's great! I see carrots and potatoes! Whoa! Nice! And what's this? There's a drill here! What? I definitely wasn't expecting something like this inside the chest! A drill. Mm -hmm. Some carrots and potatoes. It's food! Let's eat! No, wait a second. We can't eat these yet, Mikey. Why? We don't know how long we're going to be trapped in this village, right? Yeah. So let's plant these instead. All right. On top of that, we also found this drill. Oh. Check it out. Cool. If we use this. Yeah? We can build an underground kingdom. You think so? Yeah. Oh, right. Let's live underground. In the underground kingdom, we'll be safe from zombies. Nice. Let's see. If I can use the drill like this. Yeah? Whoa. Watch this. Ooh. Check it out. Awesome digging. Wow, that's the underside of your house. There are zombies up there. Right. Maybe we should dig down. Yeah. If we dig in the wrong spot, we'll have to fight zombies. Be careful. Mikey, I almost forgot. It's dangerous, so wear a helmet. Thanks. Now, hmm? let's build our underground kingdom. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, I hit you. That hurt. All right, we're founding a new kingdom. Looking good. Now we can use the underground to go back and forth between our houses. Wow! That's awesome, JJ! Okay, so... A little more digging over here. I think if I keep digging in this direction, I should reach my house. Right about here. Oh? Yeah, I'll dig up here. No! Oh, no, 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 no! Ah! That was close. Are you okay? I wasn't to my house yet. I'm glad the zombies didn't notice. Close call! Let's try that again a little further. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice! We made it to my house. Here's some ladders. I'll set them up. <sighs> okay, now we can climb inside. We finally made it! Awesome! Yeah! Oh! Let's build our kingdom! Yeah! Next, let's connect the path to your house. Is it this one here? I think so. Yep, right there. All right, now we can come up here too. Our houses are connected. Yep, via the tunnel. 
Okay, let's go back down. We need to start farming something. I'm pretty hungry now, so let's plant those carrots and potatoes before we end up eating them. Ready to farm? Let's do it! Where do we start? We'll need to place some dirt down. Oh, wait, Mikey, stop! Huh? There's something else. Um, uh, oh yeah! We need water. Exactly. We need water to make a farm. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Mm -hmm. If my memory serves me, the well should be somewhere in that direction. Right. I'm gonna keep drilling that way until I break through to the village well. Oh, okay. Here I go. Is it that way? It should be this way. If I break through the bottom of the well, then we'll have a water source for the farm. Where is it? Let's see. Mm. Uh, whoa! Whoa! Hey, hey! Yes! Our water source! We did it! Now that we have our water, Mikey, let's get started on our farm. Yeah! Okay. Awesome! That's a lot. Nice! I'm pretty thirsty. Me too! I'll fill this bottle and... That's refreshing. That's good! All right. Our kingdom is really shaping up, huh? Yeah! Let's take a look. Mm -hmm. Here's the entrance to Mikey's house. Yep. Then, over here, is my house. Each house is connected by the tunnel. That's the idea, but there's more. Look over here. It's our underground living room. Oh, nice. And over here is our bedroom. See? It's cozy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's perfect. And now look at this. Our farm has expanded quite a bit. See? Oh. We have plenty of carrots and potatoes in storage. Oh, the baked potatoes are done. Let's eat. Yum. What do you think? Honestly, it's perfect. We have no shortage of food or water. We can live here forever, Mikey. Yeah, it's so great. Hang on, what's that sound? Hmm? What is that? Huh? Behind you! <gasps> Zombies! What? Mikey, hurry! No way! <laughs> it's a zombie attack! Run! They're inside! <laughs> We gotta go! Uh. <laughs> Seriously? Whoa! Man! Sheesh! Our underground kingdom has been taken over by zombies! We need to keep this closed. Hey, I just realized something. Yeah? We left all our food behind. No! Oh. We're gonna starve to death! <laughs> we can't go back down there. What do we do now? <sighs> We're surrounded by zombies. What can we do? Plus, we have no food. Wait, hold on. Huh? I thought of something. Really? What is it? It doesn't look like much, but... Huh? What is that? Pull this lever. Yeah? Huh? It's a secret chest. I forgot about it. What's inside? It is... Yeah? Elytra! See? Oh! I hit Elytra at some point. Here! Oh, wow! This'll let us fly? Yep. Oh. We wear them like a cape. See? <laughs> Once we put them on, we can fly through the sky. Wow! If we stay here, we're either gonna starve or the zombies will get us. Are you ready to fly away? Let's go! Okay, let's get on the roof. The village is full of zombies. Let's use our elytra, Mikey. Let's fly! In three, two, one... Go! Fly away! Whoa! To freedom! Woohoo! We're just so happy to see another survivor! Could you please let us in? It's almost nighttime, and if we stay out here, the zombies will attack us! Give us some relief! Oh, so that's your deal. You want me to let you into my hideout. Yeah! As soon as possible! That way, the zombies won't get us! Hmm... So, you want to come in. But... I don't! I will never, ever let you inside! 
What? But it isn't safe out here! Please! I'm begging you! Help us! No way! This hamburger place is mine! I discovered it, and nobody else is allowed in! It's all mine! <laughs> Check out the door! Look at it, right here! Do you see that? It's a lock! I installed it to make sure no one could get in but me! <laughs> Are you serious? That is so mean! Please, you have to let us in! We don't want to get eaten by zombies! Come on! Hey! Keep your hands off my door! Do you hear me? You better not touch it! <laughs> Walk away! Cause next time, I won't miss! Now shoo! <sighs> I said get out of here! I'm serious! I'm not kidding around! You two need to leave right away! Hurry up! Now shoo! <laughs> Look out behind you! Zombies! Turn around! Quick! <laughs> oh, nice try! No one's getting in here! But it's not a trick! I'm telling the truth! There's no way that I'm gonna... Ah, zombies! Oh, wait! They're really here? I gotta get out of here! Quick! Come on! Come on! Open up! I'm begging you! Please, man! You gotta let me out! I wish I could help you, but the door is locked! Forget about it! I'll just have to use my shotgun! No! I'm out of ammo! <laughs> He's down! He was outnumbered! He didn't stand a chance! We gotta go! Go where? We're completely surrounded, Mikey! I don't know! There's nowhere we can run! Let me think. We've got to find higher ground. Follow me. Okay! Mikey, see that super tall building? Let's try to get up as high as we can. Got it! Look, there are zombies at every turn! Yeah! This might be the tallest building in the city. Let's get to high ground. Yeah. Uh, nope. Keep running! Up the stairs, Mikey. Uh-oh, there's a whole horde up here. Don't let them touch you. I'll do my best. Uh, no! JJ, are you okay? I'm fine. Let's just get up to the next floor. I think I see a staircase over there. I'm coming! <laughs> Hurry! <laughs> Aim for the roof. Oh, no. There are some up here, too. Let's keep going up. Will we really be safe at the top? I don't know, but we have no choice. Okay! Where are the stairs? Oh, I see a door. Follow me. Wait, where is it? Just stay close. Don't stop running. Yes. Come on, Mikey, hurry. <gasps> I closed it behind you. Now don't let up. Sprint to the top like your life depends on it. Let's go. Right. Oh, yes, Mikey. I see something. What is it? I don't think we're quite at the top, but we're definitely super high up. JJ, are we safe up here? The zombies won't follow us? I'm not sure, so let's climb as high as we can, just in case. All right. Is this the top floor? Hmm, doesn't seem like it. Let's look outside. Good idea. Hmm? Whoa! Wow! We're so high up! It's impressive, huh? We've come really far. I'll say. What a view! We can see the whole city from here. We sure are high up, but are we finally safe from the zombies? I hope so. Hmm? What? There's another room! Oh, yeah! See this? As far as I can tell, this door will take us to the top floor. Oh! Let's go! Yeah! Prepare yourself, Mikey! Stay alert! Hmm? Whoa! What is this place? Where are we? It looks normal. Yeah. Hmm. It looks like someone's been living here. There are beds and... What's in here? Oh, look! <gasps> Food! And water, too! 
Sorry to whoever these belong to, but we gotta eat. True that! Dig in, Mikey. This food belongs to someone else, but we don't wanna die. Don't mind if I do! Phew! Phew! Hmm. Huh? Listen! What is that? A news alert? Yeah! Put it on. This just in. A state of emergency has been declared due to the world zombie outbreak. Go! No, no! Help! Run away! Whoa! Mikey? Uh-huh? Did you hear that? It's even worse than we imagined! What do we do? Is this... the end of the world? Oh... <gasps> Quiet, Mikey! Huh? I hear footsteps, and they're getting closer! I hear them too! Oh, whose are they? Someone's coming up the stairs! What do we do? Could it be the zombies? No! It's all over for us! Oh. Uh, is it? Huh? What? What? Huh? You're not a zombie! Well... Hi! Who are you? Oh! I know! You must live here, right? Huh? Your name is Carrie? Sorry for barging in. We were just running away from the zombies. That's right. Actually... How did the city get so infested by zombies? Huh. Zombies attack the city, just like our village. Oh. Hmm? Oh, the tower is safe. So you're trying to make a new country here. Well, of course, we'll help you. Yeah! We can make a new life in this tower, safe from the zombies, with Carrie. Yep, a new life in a new country. Wow, we've made a lot of changes. Seriously? Carrie is our Minister of Defense. She protects us from the zombies. Oh! Look, this is our control room. Pretty impressive, huh? Amazing! Our population has grown with many survivors. And look over here. Yeah? This here is our zombie monitor. That sounds handy. We can even check the monitor ourselves. Just choose a monitor, and... Ta-da! See? Whoa! We can watch the security feed. Cool! An alarm sounds if a zombie shows up on camera. But there's no way for zombies to get this high up, right? You're right, but you can never let your guard down. True. Always stay on guard. Yeah! Okay, Mikey. Let's go to the top. Sounds good. We can climb up from here. Just flip this lever and... Oh. Bam! It's a secret door to the roof. Wow! That's cool! All right. What a view. Let's head to the top of the tower. There's something special up there. Really? Let's go! I hear it's something very important. Right up here. Ooh, what is it? Let's find out. Whoa. We made it all the way to the top. Look. Sweet. You can see the entire city from up here. You're right. We're so high up. Wow. 
This is what I wanted to show you. We have a sniper. Whoa! His job is to shoot down zombies that get too close. I see! Whoa! <gasps> cool! Check it out! A zombie must have gotten too close to the tower, so the sniper took care of it. That's reassuring! I feel super safe now! Great work! Let's head back. Alright! We've accomplished a lot! Yeah? I'll show you. Let's take a tour of our safe little country. What else is there? A bunch! We spent six months building this place. Let's go. We leave the control room through here. Okay. Down the stairs, and through here. Look! Oh! Check it out! Amazing! With our indoor farm, we're completely self-sufficient. That's great! So we'll never have to worry about food here? What a relief! Exactly! Next up, oh? we'll go in here. Okay. These are the sleeping quarters. Oh! I call bottom bunk! All right, this one's mine. Nice! There's still more. Okay! Ready to go further down? This way. Yeah? Here we are. See? Look, Mikey, it's our communal space. Wow! We have little shops set up. This is where everyone can just hang out. There's even an ice cream shop! The entire world may be in shambles from the zombie outbreak, but in here, you can forget about all of that. This is a safe haven. Check out the weaponsmith. He'll give you a sword anytime you like. That's awesome! There are a few different shops here. See? This is nice. Let's continue our tour. Yeah! We've put a lot of work in here over the past few months. What's next? Ta-da! You know what this is? What is it? This is a security area. Sick! This is the end of our official tour. It's way too dangerous to go any further down from here. Do you think there are zombies down there? Maybe. But if you're feeling brave, we can check it out. What? Uh, I mean, zombies haven't made it this far before, so let's go! Exactly! Zombies can't come up this high in the tower. We'll be fine. Right. Our security system is just too good. Let's take a quick peek. Oh, see that, Mikey? Huh? The camera. Oh, yeah! Check this out. That's the camera we looked through earlier. Hi there! Hello! You're right! We're on the screen! Yep, and look at this! Up there is the alarm. Mm. This is the alarm that alerts everyone if the zombies show up. Oh, I see. We have a really strong security system. Yep, and that's not all. Follow me. If zombies ever do make it up this far, we can pull this lever. Whoa, look at that! Nice, huh? Totally. It rains arrows. Wow. And then, if that's not enough... Oh, yeah? Our final weapon activates with this button. <laughs> Check it. Awesome! That's security lava. We're totally safe in this tower. Oh, and... Hmm? This is our bathroom over here. Oh, that's good to know. It's pretty roomy. Hmm. <gasps> Help! Ah here. Hmm? What? Wait. I came to Mikey's today to hang out, but... Hey, Mikey! Mikey, open up, pal! Mm -hmm. Oh, hey! What's up? Open the door! Sure! Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. There! Huh? This is your place? By the way, why is your house surrounded by a massive fence? Why? Yeah? For security! I made it to protect myself from thieves and zombies and any other terrible things that try to get me. I see. 
Yeah, that makes sense. It looks like it'll keep you really safe. I know! Guess what, JJ? I'm planning on making something way cooler than this. Way cooler? All right. What about this, Mikey? Let's make the strongest security system ever. It'll be so strong that we won't be afraid no matter what comes. That sounds great, JJ! Let's do it! Okay, let's get started on the strongest security house ever built. Come on! I imagine that this security house would be really modern and new. After all, if it's going to be the strongest security, we have to include lasers and traps. Yeah, that sounds good! Let's make some strong defenses so we can rest easy. What should we make first? Well, since we're talking about security, I think we should make something that's worth protecting. Sounds good! There. See this treasure chest? This will be the main thing we're protecting. Let's put valuables in. Oh, like what? Actually, I'll check in and see what you put in later. I'm still pretty curious about what's inside, though. It's important to plan ahead, but I think I'll focus on the house for now and the security later. All right. Let's make this house modern. First, we're going to cover the entire floor with quartz blocks. <laughs> Amazing! It sure is, Mikey. Let's take a quick look at it now. Now then, let's get building. Yeah! Let's build up the first floor from around here. Like this. We need to make a couple of pillars. Mm. Very nice. This means the frame for the first floor is finally finished. And now the base for the second floor is all filled in. We did it! The second floor should be extra fancy. Let's do it! Yeah! Fancy, fancy, fancy! Also, the second floor has lots of space we can use up. Come on! Hmm? You mean like this? Yeah. Huh. How's that? Something along those lines. The first two floors are a little stiff and square, so I thought it might be best if we added some curves to the third floor. Plus, I was thinking we could include a giant U-shaped window somewhere around here. But how? I also want to change the color. Let's use blackstone. We'll make sure the U-shape is enormous. Like this. We finished building our masterpiece. Sweet! Next, let's start putting glass up towards the ceiling. All right. How's that? This looks so incredible! I want to live in here! It looks really good already, but we still need to work on the interior. Let's go! In here is the treasure chest we gotta protect. Yeah, it's the most important part of our plan! We should build a cage around it. Whoa! No one can reach it now! Yep, that's good. Now, with these iron bars, our treasure chest is completely secured. We did it! I'm glad that's done with. Next, let's build up some more of the interior. We'll install our defenses last, so for now, let's just decorate inside the first floor. We still need to put in a living room and a kitchen. You can set up the chairs in there, and I'll build the kitchen over here. Okay! All right. I'm using this fire and making a stove. Now then... Good job! I'm gonna put a smoker right beside it. And then a cauldron. And then finally, I'll make a fridge. This tripwire hook will be our faucet. And we'll just ignore the fact that it's coming out of the fridge. All right, it looks like we're finally finished. Wow, this really is a full-on kitchen. Now it's finished. Did you make a couch over here, Mikey? Wow, it's amazing! We'll need a dining table too, so let's make one right here. I'll make it like this. There. Because it's so close to the kitchen, we can eat our meals right after we cook them. So fancy! This house is awesome! Yeah. And here's the bedroom. The bedroom's important. I want to make it relaxing. Let's put wood in here. This room is super elegant! Yeah, that's true. Here's a lantern. Oh, it looks like it started raining. Wait! You're forgetting an important part of the bedroom. Hmm? Look, what do you do before you go to bed? What? Read a book, right? Ah, <laughs> that's right! Yeah, books! Oh yeah, I almost forgot about reading! How could I? That's a lot of bookshelves. Okay, the bedroom's done. All done! Next, we should figure out a way to get outside. Isn't there a way to get outside from here? You need to get outside? We could make a secret door! 
Okay, let's get inside, but we'll try and go this way. All right, how was that? It's kind of obvious, but it's still a secret door. Yeah, it still is. Just through the vines. Hm. Go through the green? <laughs> green means go, right? Yeah, green means go. So you can head straight through the vines to enter. Green means go. Go through the green. Green means go. <laughs> All right, we finished the inside of the second floor. Where on the third floor should we set up our study? How's that? Here. Cool, thanks. Our eyes will get worse if there's no light. Studying in the dark is bad for you. Well, it seems like we're all finished in here. It looks really great now that it's done. All done. Do you have any idea what we're doing next? Next? Oh, yeah! It's time to upgrade the security, isn't it? Yep. Security time! Now, let's make some security for the treasure chest. I just need to decide on some security devices that we're going to use. Like what? What'll you pick? Let's dig a hole. Sure, let's do it. Now we'll put in the lava, Mikey. Lava? Let's put lava everywhere, except on the house, got it? Ooh. I guess that means we finished our lava moat security. How exactly do people get in? Jumping? Yeah, jumping. Yeah. There, see? Does that mean we're done? Nope, not yet. What else? We're forgetting something really important, Mikey. We need a beacon. And some pink colored glass. And finally, a few iron blocks. There, it looks perfect! This house is incredible! We finished the lasers. Our house is super secure. Amazing, amazing, amazing! Now all that's left to do is build security for the inside of the house. We need to punish any robbers who try and steal from the treasure chest. I want to set up an elaborate trap. I'm going to put a lever system here, and whenever it gets pulled, the robbers will fall into a pit. This means I'll have to do a lot of digging before the trap is complete. They'll fall down here, and they'll be stuck inside forever. Whoever's trying to steal our treasure will hit this switch, like this, and the floor falls out from underneath them. Oh, wow! That's the coolest thing ever! All right. That means now we need to start thinking about where they're going to land when they fall. Huh? What's this? When the robbers fall down, they'll think, oh, treasure, and try to open it. Then, bang! Is that TNT? I can't believe you put a trap chest on top of the TNT. Awesome! It's not a chest, but it sure looks real. <laughs> Perfect. Now then. We're finished. Yeah, the pitfall trip is complete. We also put in that dummy chest for good measure. OK, I think we have the best security possible. Now I'll explain everything. Yeah, explain. Whoa. So on the outside, we put in some pink laser beacons. Careful. I don't want to touch them. Right, or you'll take damage. These beams are also a really good way to intimidate any nearby enemies. Yeah, that's true. Next up, we have a lava moat surrounding the entire building. Nice. Any zombies or spiders or creatures that can't jump will fall straight in like this. And if we fall in, the pool's right there. Wow, so strong! We'll cool off right away. Okay, next we go inside the living room. The kitchen's over there. Our couch is the best place to relax under our fancy light source. It's like art. Yeah, like art. Here's our treasure chest. The treasure, however, is still a mystery. Only Mikey knows what's inside. Yeah, I think it's good enough for now. Great. If a thief shows up, he'll think to himself, oh, if I pull the lever, I'll unlock the cage and I can get a hold of the treasure. But when he pulls it... Ah! <laughs> Ouch! Hmm. Perfect! He'll fall through the sand and then think to himself, another chest! Lucky! And then he'll open it... But that's what will trigger the TNT underneath it! Whoa! Wow! Just like that! Well, as long as we're in here, we'll be safe from zombies. We could even relax on the couch if we wanted to. This is the best house ever. The best! Hmm. Looks like we really made the ultimate security house. We'll be fine no matter how many zombies or robbers show up. We showed them! If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave us a like and subscribe to our channel. And try to build your own security houses to see how they turn out. See ya! Bye-bye! Oh! Run, Mikey! All right. Take a look at this. Our new house is finally finished. Wow, what a nice house. And a great location. We'll have a happy life building a village here. Yeah, with this house as the start of a new village, we can live in peace. Fantastic. Hang on, 
What's that sound? There's an emergency news alert on the TV. Let's check it out. Ooh. It's about to start. What could it be? Let's see. Hmm? Uh, what's going on? Huh? Huh? What? This is bad, Mikey! What? A mysterious wriggle monster just attacked a village nearby. Uh-oh. And according to the reporter, that monster is headed this way next. What? After we finished building our peaceful home? What do we do? Hmm. Hmm? Huh? Well, Mikey, we should have at least six hours before the wriggle monster reaches us. We have until then to build some security. Let's fight off the Wriggle Monster! Yeah! Let's fight it! What kind of security will we build? The Wriggle Monster is huge! Yeah! It's so big, we need to build a wall big enough to surround the entire house! Of course! Yep! Let's do it! So, let's build a gigantic wall! Let's build it! Yeah! How's this? Whoa! Look at that wall! It's massive! That's just one section! It's huge! Our walls need to be quite thick! It's thick! I think it's five, actually six blocks wide, so it's pretty solid! And it's also about ten blocks tall! At that height, it should be tall enough and thick enough! I think we have a pretty good wall! No way the Wriggle Monster can break through this wall! Hmm. It's the strongest wall ever! Yeah! Whoa! Now we have to build off what we have so far! Okay! Let's surround the house with walls! Let's do it! Do our best! The very best! <laughs> All right! Woohoo! Wow! Check it out! Whoa. It took us a while, but we did it! Yeah! The house is completely surrounded by large, sturdy walls! That took a whole hour to make! But now we should be safe and sound behind these walls, right? Nobody can get through. Well, Mikey, hmm? sure. But we built our perfect house together, and I don't want to see anything happen to it. And since I don't want it getting smashed, just in case... Yeah? We should build some more anti-wriggle monster security. Oh. For starters, let's see here. We'll need this and that. Uh, start with these. Hmm, is that right? Yep. How's it look? What's this? Mm. What are you doing? And ta-da! <laughs> Let's build some iron golems! Of course! Iron golems are the toughest troops around! Maybe the iron golems will defeat the wriggle monster for us? They can take it, no problem! Yeah! Oh! Iron golems are the strongest soldiers out there! They're the ultimate security force! They'll probably beat the wriggle monster for us! They'll protect our walls. Amazing! There's something else I want to build. Follow me. What is it? Don't you think we have enough protection already? No, Mikey, it's not enough. We need to be ready for anything. I was thinking of using lava as a security measure. Ooh. Hmm, how about this? Good, good. Okay. That's how wide our lava defense will be. Now to fill it up. It won't make it across this much lava! Right? There's no way! Hey, hey! I doubt even the giant wriggle monster will be able to cut across this much lava! Nope, nope, no! Although, we can't make it across ourselves either, so we'll have to fix that! First, we'll raise this part up and then... Put a ladder here! Then, in the middle of the lava, some slime blocks! I see what you're doing! Now you can climb up here, jump on the slime blocks, and bounce across! Now we have a way to make it through! That's right! And the Wriggle Monster won't be able to cross the lava! The Wriggle Monster won't make it to the other side! It's perfect! I'll put one on this side, too! It's great! Haha! <laughs> Amazing! Yeah! So we're done? Awesome! I guess this should be enough! It's more than enough! That Wriggle Monster is going down! Well, let's take it easy and get some sleep while we wait! Hmm. Mikey, hang on, hang on! Hmm? Why? We can't be too safe! Just in case, we need to make the ultimate weapon. Something 100% effective that works on any enemy. 
We still have about five hours left in the day. A weapon that's absolutely effective against any enemy? What is it? You'll see. Let's start at the back of the house. Huh? First, get a shovel ready, okay. Mikey. Okay. We'll use our shovels to dig a hole in the ground. A really deep hole. Sure. How's this? How big should we make it? It should be pretty big. Let's make it a crazy deep hole. Let's do our best. Yeah. So let's make it about this big and really deep. It might take us a while. Let's dig. We can do it. Yeah. I'm tired. <sighs> we dug it all up. But we still have two hours left. That's fine. Take a look over here. We dug a hole so deep, it drops straight into the void. But still, yeah? what would fall into a hole that they can clearly see? Don't worry, we're gonna convert this into a giant pitfall trap. To do that, we'll need TNT and sand. Yeah? And we'll use redstone dust and some repeaters. Yep. First, uh, maybe here? Sure. All right, on this layer, we'll place the TNT. Let's completely cover the hole with TNT. Okay. Just like this. Yeah. All right. Great. We covered the hole. Next, we place a layer of sand, covering the layer of TNT. Sure. Just place the sand. Cover it up with sand. That's the way. Good, good. Keep at it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's done. Layer placed. All right, the last okay. one. To finish, we'll cap it off with another layer of sand. Now to line the sides with repeaters, like this. Nice. And it becomes... The ultimate weapon! Whoa! The ultimate weapon! <laughs> then... Um... That should work. Yeah! Is that a good spot to leave it? Looks good! Good! Now to cover up all of this. Oh, perfect! Perfect! All done! Yep. We'll just leave this spot open. Okay. That should be everything. It's done! So now, when we pull the lever, all of the sand should drop away. Amazing! Then, everything standing on top of that area will fall straight into the void. Our ultimate weapon is complete. Yep. That means we've completed all of our security measures. We still have two hours left until the Wriggle Monster comes. <sighs> I'm exhausted. The monster could show up at any time. Hmm? Huh? Really? Huh? It's the Wriggle Monster! It's here? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Hang on! We gotta move! Hurry! The secret door is open. Fool! Get yourself equipped! Fool! Fool! Oh, Wriggle Monster! Fool! Oh, oh, oh. Huh? The Iron Golems are even stronger than I thought! They can win! It's no problem for them! They're beating it? Too easy! I'll give support! Piece of cake! I'll support too! We can do it! It's taking damage! Attack! The walls were so thick! Attack! Seriously? The walls oh. melt away like butter! Oh no! The Iron Golems are all down! It's coming! The lava should do it! The lava is so wide! We'll be fine! It'll try to get across! We'll be fine! There's no way it can cross! What? What? How? What now? Ah! I knew it couldn't cross the lava! I knew it! The Wriggle Monster's regenerating too fast! Can we beat it? Once it's on the sand... It's not safe for you on the sand now, Mikey! Right! Once it reaches the sand... Come to the sand! I'll activate the pitfall trap! Ah! Huh? <laughs> Whoa! What? Seriously? What happened? Oh no! Hold up, it's still alive! That was supposed to be our ultimate weapon! Uh... Huh? Uh... Huh? Um... <laughs> I guess the Wriggle Monster... The Wriggle Monster slipped? It fell off? Into the void! For real? <laughs> well, our house may have been completely wrecked, but at least the Wriggle Monster fell into the void! even if it slipped on its own. What a relief!
Leaf! We fought off the Wriggle Monster. If you enjoyed today's video, please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks! Bye bye! Thanks for watching! Bye!